born in Louisville, Kentucky back in 1942 as Cassius Clay. Here is Muhammad Ali, no denying the hands. He says he's worked pretty hard on his takedown defense coming into the UFC tonight. Juan, he's gonna have to. He's the greatest boxer of all time. But he won't be just boxing that will allow for him to find success inside the UFC. But if you know Cassius Clay, if you know Muhammad Ali, you know he's the most fearless competitor that you could find. He's a tremendous boxer. Now it's time to see what he can do inside the UFC's octagon. And he's got a lot of size, he's got a lot of length. People really enjoyed the visual on the scale here on Friday. Muhammad Ali taking his greatness to the octagon here tonight. We'll see how it goes. Muhammad Ali ready to battle and take home that elusive UFC goal. respect and appreciation as we have for the skill sets of the lower weight class athletes. There is nothing in pro sports quite like a UFC heavyweight championship fight. That is a reality. You've been there. You've done that. Baddest man on the planet putting that very distinction on the line tonight. Yeah, the champ walks again, and he wears that proudly. Johnny wants to be called the champ. He loves to be called the baddest man on the planet. He is so skilled. He's so dangerous. He's so scary. And he gets up for these types of challenges. He intends to never let go of his belt. He understands the challenge in front of him here tonight, but he has been forged by this training camp, the championship experience he has accrued, and we'll see if he can lead the way he enters as the greatest heavyweight in the world. <laughs> UFC Hall of Famer Chuck Liddell, ready to engage in another high-profile matchup here tonight. And now let's get you our tail of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Championship of the world. It's a decent match. Fighting out of the blue corner. Presenting the challenger, Muhammad Ali. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC. Heavyweight champion of the world, the Iceman, Chuck Liddell. Referee Herb Great Dean fight. will handle the action right. in the octagon. Our right, round is underway, and that means keep your eyes focused on the handiwork of the Iceman, Chuck Liddell, one of the most decorated knockout artists in UFC history, and showing that the power is still there at this stage of his career. He believes this matchup to be very favorable. He knows his takedown defense will have to be on point. More often than not, it has been, and that is the focus for Chuck Liddell coming in here tonight. Nice one-two there. Another counter strike here. He has landed several in this round. And if you are a counter striking stylist, you can do worse than watching this guy compete. Beautiful job defensively, head movement, foot movement, and ultimately finding a home for these counter shots repeatedly in this round. Fast pace here in the early going. Nice crack there. Two minutes have gone by. Circling to his right. Ooh, what a punch. So he needs to mix it up. He needs to start kicking more. Beat him to the punch. Beat first. 
Well, not bad. Huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow up kill. The kill shot is what they call it for going in the fight. Oh, just opening up on him now. Massive left hand. Oh, big left hand there. Just landed a solid punch there. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Well, it's not always easy being a counter-striker, but when you can execute the style this effectively, it really is something to behold. You'll see the fall. Yeah, he hurt him real bad. He's still hurt. Lands to the body there. The fighters separate. in that kick. Twenty seconds left. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Oh. That horn sounds oh. means we have reached the end of round one. We now take a look back at some of the highlights from that last round, DC. A lot for the replay guys to choose from. I mean, these guys are going to be very busy trying to find what replay to show you guys. Lands on both sides of the octagon. Both guys fought great. What a phenomenal round. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, round two. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. He's in trouble. Like that! Oh, another heavy shot gets through. It's over! Unbelievable! The bad man stop. A nice stoppage win for him here tonight. And the other side just couldn't handle the incoming assault. A flurry of punches, most of them upstairs. And when those big shots land repeatedly, the referee has no choice but to step in and call the fight. Now, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 36 seconds of round number two. We play the winner by TKO and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Muhammad Well, DC, you know how much I love crowning.